Dark? Einstein! Where do you come from, boy? Didn't you bring Doc with you? Retrieval? In case of my failure to return to the DeLorean within an allotted time, I programmed the time machine to jump to these four dimensional coordinates without me. As you are well aware, time travel is an inherently risky activity, and despite my elaborate precautions, there's always the possibility that I could land in trouble sometime. And that sometime is now, or then, or uh, maybe later. He's in trouble. Marty, you come to my rescue in the past. Or was it the future? Anyway, I'm relying on you to do it again. Please, take the DeLorean back, or, or forward, to whatever it is I'm stuck in time. When you get there, I'm sure you'll figure out what to do. That's it? Aren't you gonna tell me when that is? Just go to the date specified on the time circuit readout under the heading marked Last Time Departed. Good luck. Right, right, Last Time Departed, Last Time Departed. Uh, oh, jeez. Come on, come on. Come on. Crap! Oh, great. How am I supposed to find him now? Okay, Doc, I know I haven't seen you in a few months, but I'm pretty sure this isn't your shoe. What do you know about this shoe, Einie? Great Scott! I think he's onto something! Okay, now we're getting somewhere. How's this supposed to lead me to Doc, Einie? Einstein, come on! Just as I suspected. Hooligans! Get along now! Scat! Can you let me in? I've got something to show you. What is it? Let me see. A shoe? What would I want with a... Huh? <gasps> Stay there! Leave that creature outside! Sorry, Einstein. Well, took you long enough. 
Um, there's a lot of stairs. To return the shoe, I mean. I lost it ages ago. You can put it down next to the other one. Mm, much better. So neat and orderly. Yeah, I suppose you'll be wanting some sort of reward now. No, I... All I've got is tea and candy. But... I'm sorry I called you a hooligan. I try not to jump to conclusions, but after all, nine out of ten people in this city are hooligans. It's a fact. Look it up. Uh... Have a seat, Sonny. You kids! Put out those cigarettes! Oh, the candy looks older than I am. Don't touch those! My newspapers are in pristine condition and meticulously organized. Not about to let some street punk get jam all over them. Mind if I take a look? Go ahead, dear. Man, these are powerful. I could see Biff going into the video store. You wouldn't believe the filth that boy watches. Yeah, he's nothing but an out-of-control hedonist. Just like his father. If there's a clue to find a doc out there, I'm not seeing it. I don't even know where to start looking. Man, she keeps it hot in here. I'll be right back with some tea. Then don't touch anything. Hey, uh, mind if I use your binoculars for a sec? Go ahead, dear. Hey, there's Jennifer's mom coming out of the market. Mrs. Parker? I find it curious that she always uses the same strapping red-headed bag boy. Don't you? If there's a clue to find a doc out there, I'm not seeing it. I don't even know where to start looking. <laughs> Is that Vice Principal Strickland? Mother never could keep little Gerald out of her clothes. Candy looks older than I am. Oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Miss Pretty Whiskers is very particular about who handles her food. Mind if I use your binoculars for a sec? Go ahead, dear. Huh. It looks like the clock tower repairs have stalled out again. Oh, the wheels of justice grind slowly, but exceedingly fine. Except in Hill Valley. 